now on BBC Two, there are all sorts of puppets for you to watch. Bits and bits and bobs. Bits and bits and bits and... Oh! <laughs> Hello there. It's only me, bobs. <laughs> I'm going to try out some new hair today. If you're made out of bits and bobs, like me, there are lots of materials to choose from. Look at this wool, for instance. Maybe this would make good hair. Let's give it a try. It's a nice colour. <laughs> it's a bit long. Oh, yes! <laughs> Ooh, it's very floppy. It's hanging in front of my eyes. <laughs> oh, oh, bits and bobs, no. Ah, here's some curly paper. Oh, this would make funny hair. Oh, which reminds me, I've got some handy hints for you. They're all different ways to make paper hair. Handy hint number one. Fold a strip of paper backwards and forwards, then open it out. Now, if you had lots of those, you could make crinkly zigzag hair. Handy hint number two. Take a piece of paper cut like a fringe and curl it round a pencil. <laughs> That's what I call curly. What do you think of this? Makes a lovely sound. Mm. No, it's not quite me. Oh. Mm. What else have I got? Uh, oh, bits and bobs. I do like these. Uh, hang on a minute, I'll try them on. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, if I just put that on. Oh. <coughs> Ta-da! Yo, just what I wanted. Curly paper eyebrows. Great! <laughs> I like these. I'm going to wear these when I go to meet some more of my puppet friends. <gasps> oh, which reminds me. When I've found two more friends, we can all go and meet... Oh, why don't you just come with us and see? Here we are. Knock on the door. Oh, hello there. <laughs> you must be Belinda. Hello. And you must be Pip. Hello. Hello, Pip. <laughs> hello there, Bobs. Oh, hello. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice to see you all. By the way, in case you hadn't noticed, I'm the king. <laughs> oh, yes, yes. But, but you can call me your majesty. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, you, Your Majesty. Majesty. Oh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> now, now, do come right in. You'll find John, uh, what's his name, waiting for you right through there. That's it. Come, come on. on. Don't uh, miss this. Oh, look at all this. Oh, bits and bobs, yes. Bobs, isn't that what your hair's made out of? Yes, it is. But don't tell anyone. It's a secret. <laughs> oh, look at all these. There's... Threads, sequins, zips, oh, and elastic. Oh, I do like elastic. It's so stretchy and useful. Uh, Belinda, you take hold of that, that's right, and uh, don't let go. All right? Now stretch, stretch. Stretch and stretch. <laughs> right, let's go. <laughs> Ow! Oh, I said let's go, <laughs> not let go. <laughs> Sorry, Bobs, I didn't mean to hurt you. Well, just be more careful next time. That could have been dangerous. Come on, Bobs, let's go and meet John. Oh, yes. He must be around here somewhere. Let's go! <laughs> After you. Doopy doopy doo, doopy doopy doo, doopy doo. Oh, oh, hello there. Uh, hello. <laughs> oh, there you <laughs> are, John. We've been looking everywhere for you. Have you? Well, hello, everybody. I'm sorry. Um, 
sorry I couldn't answer the door, but uh, I've been busy making this puppet. What kind of puppet is it? Well, if I lift up the material, then you can see that underneath my hand is holding on to a wooden stick or a rod, and that's why we call it a rod puppet. And this piece of plywood here, well, that becomes the shoulders, and the stick goes right up into the head, which has been carved from a big block of expanded polystyrene. Oh, yeah, that's very nice, isn't it? Yeah. And if I put my hand through this hole in the material, then my hand can become the hand of the puppet. Yeah, hello. <laughs> hello. <laughs> hello. Uh, do you know, because I'm a rod puppet, they call me Rod. <laughs> they do. Yeah, oh, Rod. <laughs> rod. <laughs> Oh, Rod puppets made like that. Oh, I, I, I don't know. There's no good asking me. Go on, tell them, John. Well, Rod puppets are made in all sorts of ways and from many different sorts of materials, depending on exactly what they have to do. But the basic design is the same. Yeah, go on, John. Show them that puppet over there. All right, then. All right. Let's, Bye, Rod. Let's put him down. Bye. And this puppet is going to be a spook or a ghost, rather like that one. And you can see, he's going to have a moving mouth. And what I've done is to tie a string to the front of the mouth. Do you want to pull it, Philip? There we are. When you pull the string, the mouth opens. How do you make it close? Uh, well, that's a bit of a problem, actually. What we really need is something stretchy. What? Like an elastic band? Yes, a rubber band would do just nicely. Can you see one anywhere? You've got one, Bobs. I haven't got an elastic band. Oh, I have got a... A piece of elastic? Would that do, John? Well, it might do. Let's have a go. Give it a try. What we do is to tie it to the back of the mouth. There we are. I'm threading it through that screw eye there and tying a very tight knot in it. And then tie it a bit further down the rod so that the elastic is just tight. Let's put another big knot in that. So now what happens is, when we pull the string, the mouth opens and the elastic stretches. Oh! And then when we let the string go, the elastic tightens again and closes it. Oh. Uh, 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 uh. Clever, eh? Yes, very clever. Very clever. Very clever, don't you think? Yes. Yes, yeah. very clever. Very clever. Very clever indeed. Oh, bits and bobs, yes! Oh, there you are, bobs. They told me that you were here. Oh, children, <laughs> let me introduce myself. I am the Queen, but you may call me... Your, Your Majesty. Majesty. Oh, charming, quite charming. <laughs> well, I thought you two might like to come along with me and make your very own rod puppet. Can we, Bob? Oh, of course you can. Off you go. I'll come and find you later. Bye-bye. <laughs> Have a nice time. Hmm. I'm off to find more about how puppets are made. Come on. Elaine? Hello, Bobs. When you're painting puppets' faces, you have to work really carefully, don't you? You do, yes, and it's going to take me a long time to finish this head so that it looks like this one. Oh, how are these puppet heads made? You make it in a mould, a bit like a jelly mould. Oh, <laughs> it looks all floppy. What's the puppet head made of? It's made out of latex and it's quite rubbery and light and it's not too heavy for the puppeteers and it's very flexible. Oh, I see. Are you going to make this puppet a costume? While I've been painting the heads, somebody else has been making the costumes. Oh, I'd like to see how that's done. <laughs> oh, hello there, Bibi. Hello, Your Majesty. Yeah, I believe that you are going to make me a brand new cloak. <laughs> yes, that's right. I'm going to make a, a paper robe, first of all. I couldn't possibly wear a paper robe. No, this is just to make a basic pattern to oh. see if it fits. Oh, I see. <laughs> I'm going 
to put it up against you, Your Majesty, so Ooh. to see whether it's, it's the right length. Is this what they call fitting? Ooh. Yes. yes. Could you turn around for yes. me, Your Majesty? Thank you. You're measuring it from my neck all the way down to the bottom of my robe. Yes. Oh, oh, don't, don't make it too long, Bibi. I, I don't want to trip over it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I say, it, uh, it looks like an enormous fan, doesn't it? Yes, it does, <laughs> doesn't it, Your Majesty? Yes. And here's the material... Oh, it's splendid, isn't it? Splendid. Most kingly, most kingly. And I'm going to lay the pattern on the material. Oh, oh I see. Uh, on the back of it, yes. I'm going mm. to move the pattern from the middle of the material to the edge of the material in order not to waste any. Oh, very good idea, very good idea. <laughs> well, uh, you obviously know what you're doing, Bibi, so uh, I'll leave you to it and uh, uh, I've got some important royal decrees to sign. I'll see you later. <laughs> nice piece of material, BB. Yes, it is, Bobs. I chose it because I'm making a cloak for the king oh. and we wanted something with a shiny texture which would move well when the puppet walks along. Oh. Was this the first material you found? No. I first looked at this, oh. but it seemed dull and boring. Mm. And then I thought maybe this one. Oh, that's nice and bright. Yes, it is, but it's a bit heavy. So I chose the one I'm using now, and I think it's going to work very well. Yes, so do I. I think the king will like that. <laughs> I'll leave you to it. <gasps> I think I'd better go and see how those children are getting on. It's nearly time to go home. <gasps> Bits and bobs. Oh. Hello, Queen. Oh, hello, my dear. Oh, I do like your frog. It's most becoming, most regal. Have you finished your puppet yet? <gasps> oh, hello. What's your name? Cindy. Oh, hello, Cindy. <laughs> Well done, Belinda. Well done, Pip. She's really nice. <gasps> Look at the king. I love your new robe. Oh, thank you, Philip. Yes, my, my new cloak is rather splendid, isn't it's it? It's lovely. <laughs> oh, yes, quite splendid. <laughs> oh, Bob's, I, I nearly forgot. If you're not careful, you'll miss your train. <gasps> thank you. Oh, your Majesty. Oh. <laughs> Come on, you two. Say goodbye. Bye. Goodbye, Your bye -bye. Majesty. Yes. Bye -bye. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> and I'll see you next time. Bye bye. Bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. Save some bits and pieces. Don't throw them away. Make a moving puppet today. Bits and bits and bits and bobs. Bits and bits. Bits and bobs. Stick them, how? With tape or glue? So or staple? It's up to you. Save some bits and pieces. Don't throw them away. Oh no! Make a movie puppet today. Change your mind? It doesn't matter. Think about ways to make it move. Does it work? Is it strong? Can you make it short or long? Save some bits and pieces, lots of them. Don't throw them away. Make a moving puppet today. Bits and bobs. And you can see another puppet performance in next week's watch at 10.25. <laughs> In 20 minutes, the Cat Eyes team are making music, but with some very strange instruments. First on BBC Two, a sad tale of an alcoholic father around Scotland. <laughs>